beyond the shadows of it, and help us to see the light of eternity, so we may find grace and strength for these and every time of need. To run a kimami la betri kemini na kloon, a great tava ke woka, mami may sova ke una kloon, ni le bora su kigali. Kemami la bata tu raga na sova ni a woka me bora tumbui, we ask all this in no other name, but in the powerful name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior, the family says, Amen, Amen. 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 Be seated, please. Isaiah 57, the righteous perish and no one ponders in it in his heart. Devout men are taken away and no one understands that the righteous are taken away to be spared from evil. Those who walk upright enter into peace, they find rest as they lie in death. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Kasanita Leobundi Panami. I am the daughter number four in the five siblings the second youngest in my family, and named after my dear mother's mom. Mom was the hardest working and most toughest woman that we knew. She brought us up like warriors, 
for the world we were introduced to is not for the painters of art. Although at times we came to the spring they cried, because her teachings were quite far from soft. Most of my teenage years, my friends will know that I was always grounded. She taught me that the world is not always a place for your soft side. So in every discipline, she gently installed my group to stand firm in myself, a backbone to never allow anyone or anything tell me any less about myself. Strength in my neck to always hold my head up high, no matter how tight, tough life situations might get. Eyes to always see the good in people, no matter how wrong the world may say about them. And to always understand other people's perspective. The heart to love her heartedly without judging from only my experience. And the faith to know that there's always brighter days to the cloudy ones that we may face. She was not only ours, but most people's figure of a divine mother. Dear Mom, Today is your farewell day, where we all have to come together to mourn for you leaving and also celebrate your beautiful life and legacy. I'm supposed to share a personal story or a song or maybe poetry. Do I tell them that funny one about when you saw that girl in Birmingham and you came home and made her hair cut on me? Needless to say, Tom gave me the name, name day. Or maybe the one where I left the kids with you the weekend and I came back with Lana having the same haircut as me. <laughs> or maybe the one where I had held my firstborn in hospital. And you held my arms. And I looked at you and said, Mom, look, my baby. And you cried with us and said, He said, Mom, Mother Lord, Lord. I have so many memories and stories that were funny and also heart striking. I've searched so much in my heart and my mind to find the words to comfort, for comfort to share with everyone. And I found these lyrics which I hope will give us that comfort and cradle us through this last phase. These lyrics seem to suit best. I have always been so proud ever since the day you were born and held you. I will always be with you and always be there to protect you. Take care of each other, protect one another, and always remember who you are. Be kind to each other and forgive one another and know that I'm never too far. From the bottom of our hearts, we thank you for your loyal work in raising us up, for the life lessons, for all the advices for all the love and the strength in your teaching that has been passed on to your grandchildren. As we lay your body to rest, we hold comfort in our hearts that you have made it in the place that you set out to go. We will see you again in the not so near future, Mom. Go with peace and love for Queen of our hearts. I want to say goodbye. You, to you, Mum, in front of all these people. Because one of the most important messages Mum ever taught me, you have to be strong. This is the hardest thing.
Didn't know today would be your last Or that I'd have to say goodbye to you so fast I'm so numb I can't feel anymore I'm praying you just walk back through that door and tell me that I was only dreaming You're not really gone as long as I believe There will be another angel Around the throne tonight Your love lives on inside of me And I will hold on tight place to question only God knows why I'm just jealous of the angels around the throne tonight always made my troubles feel so me when I'd fall in a world where heroes come and go where God just took the only one I know so I'll hold you as close as I can longing for the day when I see your face again but until then God must need another angel around the throne tonight your love lives on inside of me and I will hold on tight it's not my place to question, only God knows why I'm just jealous of the angels around the throne tonight Singing Tonight